ConsciousZine.com Chronicles. Hello, hello! What's up, guys? I thought I'd show my face for once. But you don't need to see me like a talking head the whole uh, video, I'm sure. And anyway, I can't see the screen, so I've got to move this up. But you get to see beautiful nature. And the screen. Okay. Let's uh, get into this one. Pretty happy about this one because it's really funny to me. <laughs> they can still see my head. Awesome. <laughs> right. Anyway, um, <clears throat> how whoop, how I beat my gang stalkers, or at least stuff them up, or at, at least waste their energy. <laughs> well, because they're trying to waste your energy, yeah. <laughs> um, Besides everything else that they're trying to do and that's beyond the scope of this video. This video is just really meant to be about um, What I'm doing to harass them back to stuff them up back uh, You know to distract them back from things that they could be doing which are <laughs> much more worthy than looking at my position every minute of every day so, let's get into it. Airplane mode. <laughs> One of my favourites. <laughs> um, because what's been happening is, I'm in a, a camping ground in Uruguay, and um, it's very obscure. And I'm right down the back of the camping ground, so they can't even see me from the road. I'm tucked under, like, bushes, as you can see. Well, I won't show you my camping, my uh, campsite, but... Anyway, I'm, I'm tucked like in the bushes and so on, and so even when they fly past, it's hard for them to see it. Um, now that I'm gathering footage of all the airplanes and stuff, I have to walk out and then, you know, take my little uh, video. So, airplane mode. <laughs> it's been my best friend lately. Basically, what's happening is... Um, they need to get my position, it seems, all day. When they do their little, uh, like I showed you in the electronic har harassment video, where they do their little network uh, error stuff and, and makes the, um, the Wi-Fi move up and down and then sometimes completely shut off for up to an hour, two hours. I have to stare, like, stuffing around with it. We'll talk about that too. Well, let's go into that first. So how I beat that is I have a backup task that I need to get done that day. And I don't know, it might be typing. It might be uh, editing a video. <laughs> so save that task until you know they, they, they're they going to put you in the bracket of the two hours of electronic harassment. Then you go, okay, I don't need the internet for the next two hours. Have fun. <laughs> and so then you're wasting their energy and you're still focused. You're still doing your work as quickly as you want to be doing it, you see. So in other words, they're not having any effect on you, which I find pretty funny. Because their whole thing is to try and affect you. Okay, so that is internet, internet harassment. How to beat that. Just have a backup task. Um... That is beating it, even via circumnavigation, and, you know, it's okay to uh, do a strategic retreat, right? That's not the same thing as losing at all. <laughs> so, airplane mode. Um, you know, this has been my best friend lately, because um, what they do is they'll, they'll put a whole bunch of street theatre past me. There's tons of cars these days, like... They have several people on motorbikes, they have several cars going past, I can tell because of where they turn, and some of them are rolling past super slow. Um, so it's very obvious. 
and like I'll show you guys the footage of this don't worry it's coming I've already got some footage anyway of the security guard rolling past at like five kilometers an hour <laughs> so it becomes pretty obvious at that point so airplane modes are interesting because um, every time I put airplane mode on they seem to fly their airplanes so it's predictable thus I get my footage of their gang stalking airplanes <laughs> actually giving me the footage and number two um, I'm wasting their energy and it's all predictable I'm making them predictable while I'm being unpredictable you see so what I do is um, I'll give you my current example at midday I'll uh, put it into airplane mode and if they change the schedule so will I <laughs> because that's what I do all day this I'm the site creator of consciouszine.net I refuse to work for your beast system now anyway so when I go to airplane mode they within half an hour they'll fly past at least one plane but it's usually several or a chopper now what I find funny about this is it takes them a whole team of people to load up the chopper, fuel the chopper, start the chopper, fly the chopper, ground the chopper, go have lunch, come back in the chopper. Meanwhile, I'm just chilling. I'm just relaxing. Oh, oh out here in nature. <sighs> anyway so they've got to do all these things while i'm just relaxing basically and getting on with my work whatever i feel like doing whatever i feel like doing <laughs> and so it's pretty interesting uh that it's just that easy to beat them so I, I recommend you guys take on the same approach you know get familiar with airplane mode um because basically as a targeted individual they want your whereabouts every minute of every day and it's so that they can do whatever they i'm not going into the technologies they use people say they've got all sorts all sorts of technologies um and that's for you guys to research and beyond the scope of this video as well but uh yeah basically you're targeted 24 7 um and if you use airplane mode you can start to waste their energy more okay because that's what they're doing to you they're trying to waste your energy apart from distracting you and etc so it's a pretty interesting way to get things done it's as simple as pressing one button for me you guys have to load up a whole chopper full of people load up the airplane fuel the airplane with the taxpayer dumbass taxpayer dollars you know so they're wasting your energy guys too all of you people who are still in the beast system they're wasting your energy yeah and i guess now we know where the uh what was it two trillion dollars went from the great uh the gfc the uh 2008 financial crisis <laughs> that two two trillion dollars went missing i guess we know where it goes yeah apart from black budget projects of whatever else to gang stalking stuff obviously but yeah so either way you you societal people are being completely robbed and i'm not robbing you it's them robbing you so i'm not the bad guy and notice all I do every day is give all of my energy into conscious zine productions, yeah, and to give light or information on many things. So clearly I'm not the bad guy. So anyway, back to airplane mode because it's so fun. And so what they'll do is they'll have to fly over to check that I'm here, to check I'm not somewhere else, you know. So via a press of a single button, airplane mode on. <laughs> I beat them with a, a button press, a single button press. Seems, uh, you know, pretty stupid to continue doing what they're doing, but they will because they've got your guys' money. And that's why I would like donations because you're giving the, the bad guys, so to speak, your energy all day long, tax dollars and so on, but you're not giving any energy to people like me. I'm not saying all of you are not, but you need to start donating more to vote for the world you want to see. Do you want to empower people like me, people like Julian Assange and so on? Do you want to empower us people shedding tons of light? Or do you want to empower these dark people who operate in darkness, yeah? 
because most of you, well, most of the people listening at the start of this video, the first hundred views or whatever I get will be all people like me, but everyone who listens to this in several years who's just a, a normal person, not a targeted individual or whatever, they're wasting your, your energy, you know. So, <clears throat> so yeah, just through a single press of a button, that's how I've been beating my gang stalkers, and it's highly enjoyable. I get to sit here grounding, just boop, press the button, get the footage of the planes flying over, so that it's maximum energy efficiency return, yeah? So that for any energy I'm putting out, I'm like the press of a button onto airplane mode, um, I'm getting uh, more energy back actually, because I get the footage and that's going to lead to views and, and, you know, stuff like that, and possibly people enjoying my footage and donating, I hope. And, um, you know, stuff like that. I get energy back from it. So, this is just one, one very simple way to beat your gang stalkers. Get very familiar with airplane mode. And like I said, with the internet harassment, have, have like a routine, like a, a backup um, task for if they do what they do to me, which is like two hours of stuffing with my Wi-Fi, then I go, okay, take my Wi-Fi. I needed a break anyway, I'll go eat lunch, go ground, and put the K1 meridian of my big toe on the ground and soak up universal energy while you guys are doing what you're doing, harassing my computer when I'm not even on it anymore. So these are just some very simple ways to uh, beat your gang stalkers. Now let me think of any other ways. Because I like to do these videos freestyle. Um, so just let me have a have a think. Yeah, another way to probably beat your gang stalkers would be when you get the the group attacks and the street theater stuff. Um, if at all you can avoid that place, like say I'm going to the shop, and they've it's lined up that I'm going to get into a, a group attack, and what I'll do is then often just walk away for five minutes, just go out of the building, because then they've just wasted all that energy on sinking that event, and then you just go, eh, nah, I can see what's going on, check you later, five minutes later you can just come back and I've noticed it'll usually be gone, and you're in the clear, and, nothing, and you see the energy is cleared, there's no uh, group attack happening. So five minutes can make the difference. Planning your daily routine can make a difference, but don't plan it the same every day because it needs to be complex. That's the reason you're a sold human. You're more complex than an organic portal. They're simple and they do the same stuff. They're predictable. You've got to be unpredictable. That and then airplane mode. So five minutes of relocation instead of staying, say, in the shopping line or something. Say you're at the checkout or something in a shopping center and you see a group attack happening on you. Um, just walk away for like one minute, go back and, and <laughs> see how the scene has changed. So then they've wasted their energy and I mean what's one minute to you, you know what I mean? So by one minute <laughs> and one button press you can easily beat your gang stalkers or at least waste as much energy of theirs as they're trying to waste of yours and try for more.